Hello, my TK friends. I wanted to talk to you today about our mystery box. We do this in class and usually I'm the one that provides the clues and the kids make their guesses. Um, and for example, clue number one might say it's shaped like a cylinder. That would be my first clue. And then I let the class make their guesses. Then I show them the second clue. The second clue is it's white shaped like a cylinder in white. And then they make their next guesses. And then we go to our third clue. You use it every day. So it's shaped like a cylinder. It's white, something we use every day. And then we come to our fourth clue. The fourth clue, it's made out of paper and they can make their final guesses and decide what they think is in my mystery box. And if you guessed toilet paper, then you are correct. Yay, good job. If you didn't, it's okay because we keep practicing and it's really good for them to think about, use their deductive reasoning. Hmm, what, you know, there's lots of things that are shaped like cylinders and they might be a soup can, it might be a jar. Um, so many things they could guess, but then when they have the second clue, they have to like narrow it down and narrow it down. So it's really good for them to use their reasoning. Well, now it's their turn. So I'm gonna send you this little PowerPoint um, and you can decide what's in the box. So they might, maybe they're gonna put in their favorite, um, their favorite stuffed animal. Maybe it's gonna be a hat. Maybe it's gonna be a book, their favorite book. Maybe it's gonna be a stuffed animal. Maybe it's gonna be a Hot Wheels car, but they have to, whatever they decide they wanna put into their box, they have to come up with four clues. And so they can, you can um, have them either tell you what the clue is and they can type it out, or I'm gonna send you a sheet of paper and they could try to write their own clues if you wanna help them do that. I know a lot of the kids really aren't ready to do that yet, but some of them might be, so I'll send both. Um, and then you will, uh, you, can, you can either write it down or type it out for me so that way we can let the um, class guess what is in your child's mystery box. Okay, and so then, and then we'll have the big reveal and on the webcam and they can show us what's in their box. If the kids wanna decorate a box, that's fine too, like an old shoe box or an Amazon box and you know, make it like their own mystery box, that is absolutely fine. But if they don't and they just want to give me the four clues on this PowerPoint, that's great. And then we'll reveal it on the webcam, all right? So, I can't wait to see what your children come up with in their mystery boxes. I'm going to assign a different child um, every day. And when it's your child's day, uh, I hope they come up with some great clues. All right. Okay. This is going to be fun. I'll see you at circle time. Bye-bye.